Hey guys, Marvel Animations, and uh, what I'm doing here is uh, I'm basically cutting out the side for this, like I said in the previous video. So we have this, and if we stand that up right, and then put this alongside. Sorry about the music if you don't mind it. Anyway, that's. That's what I'm working on. And if you're wondering what this uh, music is, sorry, my voice is a little bit croaky. Um, this, the music is driving from the top down. It's the official soundtrack for Iron Man 1. It's probably one of my favorite films from the Marvel Universe. Oh, cinematic universe. Um, but I'm going to talk more about this. As you can see, you got loads of these. You know, pretty much pieces of card. And what I do is I get uh, one of these. Uh, you know, you just engrave into there and then take it out. For example, if I was to um, do it here, I just cut there and cut it in half, and then it's done. But that's pretty much all I've been doing. And this is taking me, I don't know, maybe an hour and a half. Uh, so I'll show you what it's like when it's done. Alright guys, so this is what it looks like when it's fully painted and all that, with all the cement in between the gaps, and you know, with all its detail and all that. So this is just one of the sides that go on the side of the front of the building, which I did in the day 4, this is day 5 by the way. Um, and I just want to say something, you know, uh, from the last video where I said, do you want to see this or do you want to you know, just see me do updates? I thought, you know, why not just do updates? Because for me, it seems a lot faster if I, you know, concentrate on this and then show you it when it's finished. Sort of like how you do that with, uh, you know, many other things. But uh, I can't think of them right now as I'm speaking. Anyway, uh, you saw me paying with my fingers. I was paying with my fingers only um, because I find it's easier at first because you get the base coat and then uh, you, well, then you, you get the base coats first of all, and then you add in the detail with a, a paintbrush. But first of all, you know, you use your fingers, and then you get, you know, paintbrush, and then you just paint it and all that. It's like, oh, look, I'm painting. Anyway, um, and then you see the base coat there. That's all. That was done by uh, brush. You know, the rest and all that was done by either finger, either my finger, uh, it's index finger, or. Um, you know, painted. The gaps were painted, uh, however, the bright red was, you know, with my finger. Now, because that's now done, we can put this alongside the, you know, the first one, because, well, that's what you're meant to do. And uh, I showed you at the beginning of this video, however, now because it's finished being painted, you know, this is what it looks like. 
it looks pretty good, right? Um, mind you, it's not finished yet. Uh, and if you if you compare the brick size, they're sort of the same brick size. Brick, my bad. Brick side sides sizes. Sorry, um, but uh, you know, one's slightly darker. This side is slightly darker, and then this side's you know bigger and brighter. And uh, that side doesn't have windows or anything. That side does. Um, but I've got to make another one of this, and I was going to make it today. Right, I wasn't gonna make another one of that today, but uh, because I ran out of cardboard, you know, that's all I got left. And I'm meant to use this sort of board. Wait, I'm meant to use this sort of board, but because, you know, this big piece, you know, is not so big enough to make the side of it. And because the other one's thin, you know, th this whole chunk is thin, right? It doesn't really work. It's like saying, uh, you have. Uh, a pizza which is you know half thick and then half thin it just doesn't really look right right so um yeah as, as cool as it seems it just you know with dioramas and all that it does not seem cool so guys as i was saying i will update you when this is all done and uh you know when the windows are done uh, there's going to be like a banner here advertisement something like that and then the door then the two sides, one there, and then one on the other side. Then I've got to make two more of these, and then I've got to make the back. Then I've got to make, like, another, like, four more of these, but on the top bit here. And then, um, you know, another one of this, and then put it across there. And then I'm finished. And then I've got to make a roof that, you know, and then I'm finished. So, with all those stages... It's going to take a lot of time, but I should be able to finish it this week. So, because I have nothing else to do. Um, but it doesn't matter, I'll still do it anyway, even if I had lots of things to do. Uh, and you remember in the previous video, that was just, uh, you know, the whole thing was just being cut out, you know, that's all. Uh, and now it's all painted and all that. But if you really like the idea, you know, the, this, how it matches. At first I couldn't see how it matched, and then I literally just took a step back and it matched quite well. Oops, just need to glue it. I'm going to have to glue these together. I know it's probably not the best thing to do, but I'm going to have to for this. Um, and because I'm making a X-Men series called Age of Apocalypse, uh, you know, not a rip-off of Age of Ultron, but for, you know, X-Men, but Age of Apocalypse, I'm going to have uh, a Sentinel in there, and then I'm gonna have all the X-Men characters, and then I'm gonna I'm pretty much gonna go up to episode 12, I think it is. I've got a whole script for it. Um, but I won't show you the script because well I haven't started doing the animations and all that. However, I will do it behind the scenes and all that sort of things, which is really cool. But anyway, thanks for watching guys. This is Marvel Animations. And uh, you know, stay tuned till this is finished. But because I'm doing it uh, because I'm doing the update sort of thing, the next video you're going to see is not day six, not, you know, update two, but it's going to be another figure, figure review, sorry, my bad, uh, I just got a sore throat, so, uh, another figure review, and it's going to be on the Iron Man Mark 1 version 2 Hot Toys figurine, and I honestly cannot wait to show you it. Thanks guys for watching, this is Marvel Animations. Keep doing what you're doing, like the video, comment below, I, I respect all that sort of stuff, and I definitely respect the people who suggest things, like, uh, Hisham, he suggested this sort of thing, like, you know, collection, diorama sort of thing, so if it wasn't for him, then none of this would actually have come to my mind, and, uh, also, you know, he suggested for me to get Venom, and then I looked at the Marvel Select Venom, and I was like, yes, you know, I must get this, Glenn Webb loves this figure, DGDX Animations, this is one thing I do want to say, uh, before this video ends, if you do include Venom in the, uh, Justice Assembled, right, I would love to be Venom, you know, uh, I think his name is, uh, Edwin Brock, 
Brooke, anyway, in the movie. But I would, I've always wanted to be at least Spider-Man or, Spider or Venom. Those are the two characters I've always wanted to be. So if you do happen to include him in the, your animation, could I please be the voice narrator? That's just something I'm asking, right? I'm not saying please, you know, you have to, like, I'm just saying please, you know, because it's just one thing I've always, you know, wanted to be. It's either Spider-Man or Venom. Those are the two. I've never actually liked Toxin. I like that, you know, his appearance and all that, but it's... He doesn't really speak at all. He's like, uh, he's like saying the baby or venom, like an offspring. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Actually, it's a hybrid, but anyway, thanks for watching, guys. This is Marvel Animations. This is the last of the vlog series, uh, and I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed it. Uh, if you didn't enjoy it, I don't blame you because you know it's just this and it's not animation or it's figure reviews. Anyway, thanks for watching Marvel Animations. It's just a little scale to show you. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye-bye animations. See you guys next time.